Okay, uh, here's a video about uh, adding an external solar panel to your 2021 Revel. Uh, picked this up from a company called Echo Power. Uh, 120 watts, foldable. The price you see on there, disregard it. Add it to your cart, let it sit there for a bit, and you're going to get a little pop-up saying make offer. So I made an offer that was $75 off and scored the whole setup with the cord for $265. Um, did have a little issue with it though. Uh, bought the you know the extended cord so I could put it out uh, you know farther away from the van and uh, get it in direct sunlight when the van's in shade. Problem is the polarity is incorrectly labeled on these things. That shows a positive. That's not positive. Uh, I've put red tape on it to correct that. But what happened was that I plugged it in with it just the way it was, came out of the box and noticed that the the amps on the um, display actually went down on the solar controller and then it just went back to normal well then I went back and realized it had blown a fuse um, so I had to pull the connector out and replace the 15 amp fuse um, and then go get a polarity reverser for the uh, charger cord which is readily available on Amazon got that Corrected the polarity, um, made sure I marked up the cables and got it all plugged in. There's the uh, polarity reverser. So it unfortunately it adds a couple inches to the cord length, but it works fine. And you can run this out the door with the doors closed. So it's it's a pretty slick system. For the price, I think it's the best bang for the buck, other than the fact that it triggered a fuse and set me back a couple days. So it's 1.9 amps of charging on an overcast day that's the two panels on the roof and this one just laying in the driveway um, gonna unplug it and go back and check again it's terrible conditions for solar but and so it's dropped to 1.3 so it, it definitely works um, on a hot day it's gonna help keep the batteries topped off it's got a little prop uh, devices there on the back. It's got a storage compartment where you can keep all the cords when it's uh, getting ready to put it away. Folds up into a neat package. It's fairly small and it just fits right in the van. I put it um, just above one of those storage containers there, kind of wedges between that and the bed. And you can see my second shower, external shower tent right there, the green thing. But yeah, it works good. Uh, just check your polarity. I should have used a voltmeter. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later.